Hello, everyone, and welcome to Thursday Night Football. We've got this headliner matchup between the two NFC Titans, the Green Bay Packers and the Arizona Cardinals here in Arizona. I'm Hude, and I will be commentating with Trevor. What's up? I don't know if I call these two the Titans. You know, there's another they're, team to forget. They're among the Titans. Of among course, the they're Titans missing you. We can't have a third yeah, football I was gonna, team in a game. I was going to say, you're forgetting the team here. Man. No, no, no. I know who's the company with me. You're making me feel a little left out. Yeah, there's a, another Titan in the booth. Obviously, he's referring to the Bengals. Of course, yes. Of course, yes. The Bengals always. And Kyler Murray, oh my goodness. Wow, those are some good stats. Who wow, have 14 touchdowns, four interceptions, 1,500 yards. He's been amazing this year for them. Definitely what they've needed here in the sim. In the sim and in real life. Mm -hmm. Let's be real. Now Hopkins in motion here at the 25. We start the game with a pass, and there this we pass go. Rush. This, okay, this pass rush is insane. Last game, yeah. they did so many sacks. Oh my gosh, I think Von two, Miller's already hit his milestone for the year. <laughs> I think uh, two of their members um, mm -hmm. are already Tyler like... throw and finds Hopkins, and he's going to be just a yard short of the first down, a gain of 22. Third and one coming up here, and been an interesting start here on this drive. And at the 34, Kyler to throw, rolling out to his right, scrambling, trying to get away from Von Miller, and he's going to get the first down and get pushed out of bounds here. Nice gain there of 10 yards. And Trevor, any uh, keys to the game here tonight for both teams? So the the one thing this Arizona um, you know offense needs to do is just keep this defensive line away from them. Away from Murray. Oh, and because... Christian Kirk with a lot of space here, and they're going to get to the other side of the field. Nice game there of about 30. And anyways, you bring up some points there, Trevor. I'll let you continue. Um, yeah, because, you know, in the earlier few, the first few games of the season, you know, this past, you know, this offensive line was p part of the reason, you know, they lost a few games, mm -hmm. uh, notably the Rams game. And, uh, you know, they're facing one of the best um, pass rush in the league. You know, they this team leads the league in sacks with 32. Mm -hmm. They have two members in the top five for uh, most sacks with Von Miller and Zadarius Smith tied at number two with 10 each. Mm -hmm. the, the only other team that's even close to them as sacks is the Bucks with 27. And, mm -hmm. you know, that's still five off from the like, – they're five sacks below the, the Packers are. Mm -hmm. So th this is mm -hmm. the best pass rush in the league, and that's, that's the key for the Green Bay Packers – uh, defensively is just getting past this O-line and this the key for the Cardinals if they want to win this game is to stop this deep, uh, defensive line. Mm -hmm. I would absolutely agree. I mean, that's going to be key here for the Packers to take advantage of the weakened O-line mm -hmm. and now Christian Kirk in motion here at the 11. Now third and goal. Kyler with a lot of time to throw. Scrambling out to his right. Going to try to go for the touchdown. He's just going to slide there. He could have gotten it. He could have gotten the touch. He could have gotten it. Yeah, you should definitely fought for it there as now fourth and goal here with a chance for the field goal to take the lead early in this one. Here at home, it is up and good. And the Cardinals take a early 3-0 lead, driving down the field to start with. But yeah, this is one of those drives you definitely want to start off with a touchdown there. As they kick it off here to the Packers, um, as they get their night started here with the return, and they're going to get stopped at the 18-yard line, and that'll bring out Aaron Rodgers and this Excellent Green Bay Packer offense here as we look at him. Wow, okay, those are some good numbers too. Whew, it's going to be a battle of the quarterbacks tonight, isn't it going to be, Trevor? Oh, yeah, and, you know, you know, uh, Aaron Rodgers and this broken X-Factor gambler, you know, mm -hmm. allows him to not throw many interceptions uh, mm -hmm. while also just continuing to put up stats. And now throwing him deep here, right and he's away. got Devontae Adams he's got a wide touch, open. Like a touchdown in one play. One wow. play, they've already outplayed the Cardinals. Unbelievable there as they score really quick. Their 82-yard touchdown for Devontae Adams just gone as soon as he caught it. And like I said, if you're Arizona, you can't come out of these drives with anything less than touchdowns here as the Packers get off to an awesome start here. And... Already with his 16th touchdown of the season for uh, Aaron Rodgers. Off to an excellent start here. As With uh, this first quarter here, a lot of action so far. A lot of great plays by both teams. And 
Now with that touchback, it'll bring back Kyler. And as you mentioned earlier, the offensive line going to be key here. But the big thing they're going to need is Saquon Barkley now here with a run. And so far not having much success. And he's been kind of been secretly one of the players they've used a lot uh, over the course of this season. So they're really going to hope for tonight. Uh, Saquon just, you know, winding down the clock a little bit and give them a little more control in this game. As Now Kyler scrambling out to his right, and he's got space, and he's got lots of space, and he's going to slide there. Nice gain to bring them up to the uh, Packers. Uh, no, Cardinals 48 here. Excellent scramble there on second down. Now at the 48 here, fakes the handoff, and Kyler's going to scramble again. Lots of space, and he's going to get tackled instead of slide, but a first down found. And the Cardinals, once again, move down the field quick here. The Packers' defense. Yeah. Uh, Kyler runs... Murray, probably the best running back on this team. <laughs> Even with Saquon? Even with Saquon. Well, Saquon's injury-prone. He had one good season his rookie year, and then he's got fucking hurt ever since. Fair enough. As now at the 34-yard line of the Packers here, second and seven. <laughs> They're Fakes just the handoff running. again, and he's going to scramble in one more time. Big play here, and that'll <laughs> be a gain. <laughs> They're just running read option. Read option is the way to go tonight as Kyler Murray already off to 70 yards on the ground, and we're not even out of the first <laughs> quarter. And he's going to scramble again, but this time, Kenny okay. Clark. <laughs> Seven rushes him. for 71 yards already. Unbelievable. As we end the first and quarter. It's, it's just the first quarter, too, and he has 71 rushing yards. <laughs> wow, we have uh, been off to an excellent start here in Arizona as – just as expected, these two teams are just dogfighting it out here. As now at the 18th, Arizona chucks it over the middle and finds the tight end, Evan Ingram. And that's the fifth straight completion. Five for five with 82 yards here for Kyler. He's been already off to over 150 yards combined yardage in one quarter. And, oh, we got a flag here. Penalty coming out. Holding supposedly on the offense as that'll be going against oh no Eric Ebron and now they'll push themselves out to the 15 and yeah this drive here uh, I would say it's pretty vital for them to score wouldn't you Trevor yeah uh, definitely especially since against such a dominant defense you really got to take all the points you can get early mm -hmm. on because yeah. towards the end of this game this team is going to make you regret every missed opportunity you got Absolutely. I mean, already Packers struck blood with the first play on offense. So let's see here with 15 yards to go. Saquon going to scrant run and he's going to not find anything there. It's been a tough day for Saquon Barkley so far. Now third and goal here, 14 yards away from the end zone here at home, Arizona. Now Kyler to throw, trying to roll out to his right, gets past there. He's got to make a decision and he's just going to run out of bounds and... Uh, uh, Kyler makes an for... interesting decision there. Um, <laughs> have the second time, second time he's made a decision like as that. They're going to kick go the field. These are again. just opportunities here that Arizona needs to convert on if they're going to stay in this game here. They're handing the Packers basically the keys to the car if they score another touchdown here at this rate. As this first half, I mean, I'll tell you what, it's got a very distinct air of a playoff game if you can you know get a sense of it here as i'm taking the knee here the smart decision that'll bring back aaron Rodgers for his second play here on offense after that 82 yard touchdown and throws it to tanyan who's tackled immediately for the six yard gain and now second and four coming up here so far uh, any uh keys to the game here for the packers um i mean just let aaron do his thing uh, you know, you got probably one of the best quarterbacks in the league right now, um, mixed with, you know, the best wide receiver due in the league with A.B. and Devontae Adams. Mm -hmm. um, just oh, it, and almost picked off right there. That's that something the Cardinals bad. needed to get. Well, they did force him to punt, but that would have given mm -hmm. them a better field advantage. As now with that punt here, it'll put them in decent field position with the fair catch at their that's own unheadful. 34. That's unheard of. A fair catch? Yeah, I know. On a punt? I mean, that's just... Well, they are playoff teams, right, so you expect bro, they would have better awareness. Are we going to say this every fair punt catch? I just... I just it, well, I mean... It, it I, I feel like every, every, video, every, every video that has a fair catch in it, so you know, like three um, has us have that reaction. 
as now Kylo to throw here at his own 34, checks it out to his right, or sorry, left, and Saquon tackled immediately, and that will be a loss of one. Nope, that's Ronald Jones. Ronald Jones. Pardon me there. And Rashawn Evans with the tackle. And, wow, this has been a interesting first half, to say the least, here from both teams. It's probably the first play. They haven't really pushed it down the field there. Uh, yeah, interesting decision to just check it out to his left. Um, as now we get back here for second down and... So far, the Packers defense, more of a bend but don't break mentality here tonight. And, I mean, that's something you're going to have to, you know, be okay with considering just how star-powered this Cardinals offense is. As Saquon finally with some positive yards on the ground brings it to third and eight here with three minutes to go in the first half. Kyler to throw, running out of time, and he's going to get sacked by Zadarius Smith. Both of the defensive ends uh, just making a present felt tonight here in this first half as they force the three and out here, and the defense comes up big just after the Cardinals catch a break there on defense, and now you're going to have to punt it back here. Just, uh, yeah, not a great drive here for the Cardinals. Definitely would have been nice to score some touchdowns on those last two possessions. It's, now they oh, punch it away. Because they're, you know, going And he's going to return this time and sheds off one. And that's going to go out to the 21. And with two minutes and 27 seconds left here, what's uh, what's in store for us here, you think, Trevor? You know, this game has already been surprising me so much. I'm not even really sure what to expect. Mm -hmm. Um. <gasps> Wow, okay, that's the second time now they've thrown out to number 30, and the second time he's dropped the interception that would have been huge for the Cardinals as now the Packers need to find a way here to make something happen on offense, and they do now as nice play there from Aaron Jones to get the first down as, well, that's I think what the third completion of the day, despite the fact that they had, you know, one 82-yard play, not too much been really going on here with this Packers offense. Yeah, it's really been the defense that's been the bright spot on this team this game so far. Um, and, I mean, it's it's so early on the game, you know. Uh, it's only the first half uh, mm -hmm. before we can say that. But this, it's just, you know, both these defenses have really shown this is a really a defensive game. Oh, and he's got – oh, is that not pass interference considering he was tackling him? You know? uh, that's they, weird. Yeah, that's weird. Uh, second and 10 here after that failed slip screen. And Aaron Jones is going to get some space, and he gets a nice gain of about eight there on that play. Sorry, nine. As now third and one coming up here for the Packers at their own 40. Henry, they're basically the same person. Oh, and nice pass there. And sheds a tackle, an excellent play by number 82. Uh, I don't particularly know who that is. Kadarius Tony. Finally oh promoted. Gosh, finally. finally promoted to you know a relevant spot in the roster instead of just like the sixth receiver. And Roger running out of time to throw up. finally does and throws it out of bounds. Wasn't he inside the uh, the box? Um, not sure if he can throw that away. Anyways, Aaron Rodgers here to throw again out to checking it uh, to Aaron Jones and that'll be a timeout here from the Packers. Strangely enough. Um. Well, now that they're on the other side of the field here, at, yeah, I can hear you. All right, was it was it messing up again? Nope. Oh, so my mic did the thing where it does where it cuts out. <laughs> a nice throw over the middle there for Devontae Adams, and they call another timeout here, but I don't understand why. I think you could just run the hurry-up offense in this case as we uh, get a small stoppage here, and now we're back to the game. With 56 seconds left here in this first half, 34 yards away from another score here for Green Bay. Aaron Rodgers to throw, scrambling out, and he's going to take the sack here. Oh, my gosh, and that's going to be a huge sack for Leo Williams. A loss of 13 on the play. Terrible decision-making there from Aaron Rodgers. 22 seconds left. Still have us a timeout. And a, Run it. Oh, another my sack. gosh. Another sack. Man, I mean, this has really been like a defensive game right here. And um, they play themselves out of field goal position all of a sudden. As now we hit third and 33, and looks like they're going to run the ball. Aaron Jones, and he's going to get stuffed up there uh, by Harold Landry, and that'll call another timeout here uh, for the Cardinals. And they may get the ball back here with 13 seconds left and two timeouts. Potentially, they could do something here to take the lead back in this one. 
Now 10 seconds, 9 seconds, 8 seconds here, and he doesn't fair catch it. He's going to try to run it back, and he's going to get stopped there with 5 seconds remaining here at their own 30. Kyler Murray, let's see what he can do here before we end the first half. Now to throw, only 3 rushing, running out of time, scrambling out, and he's going to chuck it deep, yeah. all the way deep. And oh. it did the Madden thing where everyone catches it, so it just gets dropped. And incomplete there. <laughs> And despite the fact it's been five, it's only seven to six, it's certainly been an a offensive duel with the Cardinals driving deep but just unable to get into the end zone yet as it's been a uh, back-and-forth game. But any analysis here after this first half of football? I mean, besides really the, the first play from Aaron Rodgers, this Packers offense has not been doing as well as the Cardinals offense has. It's just their defense has been doing well enough to stop them to, from getting touchdowns. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, this is really just a defensive game where the only teams that are winning are the ones that get lucky. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and I know, think the, that's... The, the, only, the only team that wins is the one that gets that one big play. Yeah. And at the moment, that's Green Bay with that, you know, 82 yard touchdown. But uh, you, know, mm -hmm. you, don't, you don't know. Yeah. And it's been a really interesting one here as both teams have tried to establish the run game, but neither have been too successful here as now we head into the second half here. Uh, the Packers didn't really have too much uh, possession in that first half, so let's see if they can try to sustain something here as they start with the ball this for the second half here. And for Arizona, you know, if they can get another defensive stop here and get the ball back, you know, there's a way here they can claw back and take the lead back in this one here. I mean, honestly, outside of the 82-yard play, they've been pretty definitively the better team here as now they kick this one off here to the Packers, and he's going to return this out to the 24 and. You know, Green Bay here needs to just, you know, hunker down here on offense. You know, they've got a, still a whole half to play. You know, don't get too complacent as now we'll see here as Aaron Rodgers takes his first snap here of the second half. Handing it off to Aaron Jones, and he's going to try to plow his way fourth, and that'll be a gain of about four, sorry, three, second and seven coming up here. And yeah, both you know, teams have been really struggling to establish this run game. Yeah, um, and it's been surprising here against this, you know, with this strong offensive line that they have. As that they've soon as we with. say that, as soon as the say oh, as soon as we say as it, as soon as we say that, a big rush from Aaron Jones. Nice play there by Jones, and that'll put them onto the 45-yard line here near midfield, and starting to, you know, see some life here. As you know, so far this Cardinals front seven has done a good job in just containing, you know, Aaron Rodgers from scrambling and getting a couple sacks here. So. If they're going to stay in this one here, they got to continue to get the best of this amazing offensive line. Got to continue to put uh, pressure oh. on this team. And throws a dangerous throw there to Devontae Adams, but gets his hands on it for a three-yard gain there. And I don't really understand what's this, you know, decision to continue going with these short throws that don't really have much run after the catch, you know. I mean, it's Devontae Adams. He was going to catch it. But... As Big sack here from Harold Landry, and he's been really great for them this year as now third and 17. I mean, Harold Landry's been really huge for the Cardinals defense in this one so far, and the big and sack in, here. In general, you know, they, he won them the first game against the Titans, for, against his former team from a blocked mm -hmm. field goal that he blocked. Um, mm -hmm. And he's just he's just been huge ever since getting traded to them from the Titans. And throws it out of bounds here, and... Again here, another empty possession here for the Green Bay Packers. It's just been ever since that first drive, nothing going for them as they punt it away now. It's the Arizona Cardinals, and oh no. Never mind, they got lucky <laughs> as it bounces in the end zone for a touchback, and the Cardinals make the right decision as Kyler coming back out here, and they got to find a way here to just punch one into the end zone. I feel like you know if they can score here, they really put the Packers on the back foot, potentially, in this one. As Now, Kyler handing it off here to Saquon and gets a nice gain of eight there. And I thought you were about to say uh, Kyler was the one rushing, and I was about to correct you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it certainly feels like that's been their main running emphasis. As Now, Saquon runs it again for the second straight play and gets a gain of about three. And now it'll be a first down here. Now with about four minutes left in the third quarter. Here at home, Kyler Murray on his first drive of the second half. Run out of time, got to throw it. Finds a man wide open there, and that's Julio Jones with, I think, the first catch of his night. Uh, nice play there 
as now they get themselves at the 43 yard line nearing midfield once again. I forgot they have Julio, man. This this Cardinals offense is just stacked. Yeah, yeah Kyler Murray and one. read option here. Nice gain of about 13 on that play as now at their Green Bay 42 here again here. I mean, one thing they've done really well, I mean, their, you know, playbook has been pretty solid. You know, their execution's been really solid up until they get to the red zone. So if they can find a way in this half to kind of clean it up here, they could, you know, potentially take a very vital victory here for their division. They can just find a way to hold on. As now, Kyler. Why did it look like his offensive lineman? Why is he running out? And why did it look like his offensive lineman was trying to tackle him? Yeah, strange play there as he throws it away. His offensive lineman uh, just forgot that he was on the Cardinals there. Maybe he uh, played defensive line in high school. Whoa! Oh my goodness. Blocked by Vaughn Miller and an injury timeout here to DJ Humphreys. And that's going to be a huge momentous swing here. Third and 10 here for the Cardinals at the 42-yard line of the Packers. This is a... Uh, I think Kyler Murray's bugged. Yeah, <laughs> what is he doing? Uh-oh. Oh no. Oh no, Kyler. No, not on third down, Kyler. Not on third down. It's not it's not just Kyler. Look at um Oh no. Is that ten? Oh dear. Oh dear. This is Oh yeah, look at that. <laughs> look at Kyle, Christian Kirk at the yeah. bottom of your screen, folks. The second right receiver you'll see right above DeAndre Hopkins is doing a you know, doing the Dougie over there. It, it, huh? It's doing it does the Madden glitch where it just literally will not let you spike or um you know hike hike the ball. The ball. As the referee uh, excited to finally call a flag here as delay a game against the Cardinals, uh, just Kyler Murray, you know, he just wanted to take a little dance break, you know, <laughs> with the boys here. And how it, Dude, I, don't, I don't see Kyler Murray with how he's rushing. All I see is um, Derek Henry, man. Yeah, man. Derek, the smallest Derek person Henry. in the league compared to the biggest. Kyler now throwing out to his running back, and he's shifting out a little bit. Saquon knows he's going to get tackled there at the – Packers 40, interesting decision to throw it short there on third down. But since they're at the 40, maybe nope, they're gonna go for a punt instead. Granted, there's you know, this is you know, this has a lot of time left in the game. So, you know, you trust your defense, which has come out big for you here, and oh no. And never mind, they get them at the eight here as the punt turns out to be not so bad. And now the Packers stuck in their own 10, inside their own 10, as Aaron Rodgers coming back out here. Been an interesting second half so far, wouldn't you say, Trevor? Definitely. Um, it. I mean, just as interesting as the first half. Yeah, been a... some questionable plays, some really terrible bugs. Mm -hmm. As um, now Aaron Jones running out to his left and gets stopped there for a gain of two and. Now third and six coming up here for the Packers, and if they punt this away, they give the Cardinals some great field position, so they kind of really need this first down. Now he gets that first down. Cody as Brown with the first down. As he gets a nice play there, shedding a man off, and gets a nice gain there of 15 or 18. As now first and 10 at the 29-yard line as the Packers bail themselves out here. We'll see if they can do it again. Rodgers to throw. Thorn out to his left, finds Devontae Adams, and that's a gain of about eight, I would say. Seven has been an interesting. Another, yep, go ahead. Another thing I've noticed this game is just really poor running back play by every running back not named Kyler Murray. <laughs> I mean, he's basically, the, the he's, he's basically the running back at this point. As now uh, X-Factor activated here for Aaron Rodgers, finding Drew Sample for the uh, seven-yard gain. Fakes the sweep out to Tooney, and Devontae Adams has a little bit of space, and he's going to get a 13-yard, no, 14-yard play there. Already better rushing than fucking Aaron Jones. <laughs> As <laughs> with that here, the Packers get to the 43-yard line here of the uh, Cardinals, and things are looking a little interesting here as now Packers starting to potentially sustain a bit of momentum, and oh no, tough play there as it bounces off of Devontae Adams' helmet, and... That'll leave two seconds left here in this third quarter. Still tons of time here, and looks like they're going to go with the two, two back set, the I formation. Fakes the handoff, and a bit of time here. Oh, my goodness. Uh, as we end the third quarter here, no points scored in this quarter yet, but it's been an interesting chess match, uh, match between these two teams so far as 
So interesting formation here. Uh, that's uh, quite a number of receivers. Now five out wide. We're at the 43 with the fourth quarter starting here. And third and 10. Quickly throwing it out. Oh, almost done there. But Buda Baker comes up with the big defensive stop there. And once again, another punt coming in this one. And haven't... Uh, have you been surprised by the lack of uh, points scored in this game, Trevor? Very. These are two high-powered offenses. Like, th there should be more points. You know, I you got it. on mm -hmm. the Cardinals side, you got Kyler Murray, Saquon Barkley, Julio Jones, and DeAndre Hopkins. And on the Packers side, you got Aaron Rodgers. Oh, Von Miller. Oh, my goodness. It's a great completion there to Julio Jones, who hasn't really done too much in this game so far. Finally getting a good catch there as now at the 29-yard line here, the Cardinals with that completion here. And, you know, this game is still a one-point game as here at home with a bit of momentum now. Kyler, he's going to think about it. He's going to throw out his left instead of scramble and goes incomplete there. Some interesting decision there. <laughs> and we take a look at the offense here with 195 total yards. Uh, earlier in the game, they had 140 in just the first quarter. It just kind of tells you how the game's progressed ever since that first quarter. As now Julio Jones, a nice catch, and he's starting to get the ball a little bit more here in this one as nice completion there. And uh, the Arizona offense now at the 45-yard line and this, uh, you know, not enough credit's been given to this uh, Packers secondary, you know, coming up big against these big receivers here oh. now. Oh, no! Huge fumble. And is that J Dyer picked it up? Oh, That's, my goodness. I, it, pick no, six. Oh, no. Dyer Alexander, right? No way. Yeah. Then they fumble it, and Jair Alexander picks it up and runs it back here, and the Packers finally get another score in this one, and the Cardinals... Those two field goals coming back to bite them here is Saquon. Saquon. Huge mistake oh, here. Who was 57? Is that Rashard Gary? I think so. As Rashard Gary forces the fumble that Jair Alexander picks up for the touchdown. Nobody there to stop him as, wow, what a turn of events here for the Green Bay Packers after struggling this entire game since that Devontae Adams play. The defense does it again here with this time putting some points on the board. And now the Arizona Cardinals are behind in this game by eight points as it's still a one possession game here as tackled here by the Packers. And, you know, if you're Green Bay, I, I'm kind of surprised they didn't go for two there. Well, you know, their defense has been getting it done all game. I would trust – I'd go for one and trust their defense on this mm -hmm. because, I mean – this Cardinals offense, as many with as many weapons as they have, have not had an answer to this defense. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. They've really struggled ever since the first quarter to sustain success. Hit as he throws. Throws it deep. Caught by DeAndre Hopkins. What a play. A total jump ball. And he gets that grab. And now at the 42-yard line of the Packers, all of a sudden the Arizona Cardinals with a finally a huge play here on offense. We've... Not seen too many of those here today, but it's just that when it matters, man, your big players, you just give them the ball and they come up big. As now here with five minutes left here in this fourth quarter, this entire game here can be really swinging here. Just the turn of two possessions is a flag out on the field, sheds a tackle there, and we'll see what this flag is here. Oh my goodness. Another holding call against the replacement tackle, Ty Sambrillo. And it's uh, the Cardinals here with a huge mistake. Now first and 20. And yeah, this has uh, been an interesting turn of events here. Now Kyler going to throw out to his right. Find Saquon with a lot of room to run. And he's got about a gain of 24 there. And they're at the 26 now. And you know, I'm, I'm, really, I'm really surprised he was able to catch that and run without getting hurt. Absolutely, <laughs> really good improvement from Saquon right there. Absolutely, as now, I mean, this possession you got to come out with seven. There's no doubt in my mind. You got to at least come out with seven. As Kyler throws out to his left, finds Ronald Jones for a gain of nine. As now the Cardinals, with under four minutes left in the game, have a chance here to potentially tie this up. Now Kyler should have just scrambled and uh, tackles there, and well, at least to get the first down. That's all I can say on that play as Evan Ingram with the catch is second of the night. 
surprised he didn't drop that one. Yeah, that's, that's another surprising thing. Saquon <laughs> not getting hurt and Evan Ingram uh, not dropping passes. I could come up with the jabs is now. Sweep here from Kirk, and he's going to get about a gain there of five. And as we look at the Packers, uh, fourth in the uh, you know league here in takeaways and certainly showing up tonight, as we'll see here now in the red zone, need another big stop as Kyler needs to get a score as well. Scrambling now, and could have, what are you that's doing, That's another chance dude. where he could have gotten the what touchdown. What are you doing? And he just slides. Um, oh, come on, Kyler. That's like just poor decision-making is – Possibly going to cost him this game. Third and three. Wide open DeAndre Hopkins for the touchdown, and it is a game now. Going for two to tie the game up here at 14. Two minutes and 34 seconds left. For two points to tie the game, Kyler Murray. Throw it out to left. Wide Ronald open. Ronald Jones. Ronald Jones. Toe tap stays in bounds. It's a tie game within two drives. Two touchdowns, and we're tied at 14. What a turn of events. And that just this tells game, me, man. This what is, is this game? This is a good game. This has been a good game. This has been a great game here it's as now. It's been a really defensive game. If somebody you know? who has been really disappointing tonight, it has to be Aaron Rodgers now throwing it over the middle and gets a nice catch there from Tooney, and he's now making a little bit of uh, – Work here done now with two minutes and 14 seconds left with three all three timeouts. Both teams have all three timeouts, and we have a two-minute warning still left. Plenty of time left in this one for either team to make a, another point you know, here to get the lead. And you know you have to be a good quarterback when 11 for 17 and almost 200 yards and a touchdown is disappointing from you. Yeah, well, I mean, tonight against a legitimately real threat to them in the NFC, you know, these you are games they have to pull off. You know, as you now Aaron Rodgers with loads of time to throw, finally throws it, finds a man here as Antonio Brown with a nice catch there. And now they're at the 41-yard line of the Arizona Cardinals as now under a minute 40 left. Rodgers to throw, check down there to Aaron Jones, double covered, but still gets the grab. Now three-yard gain, and things are moving fast here. No huddle offense, trying to make this the last drive of the, the uh, regulation. You're throwing it deep. Antonio oh, Brown! Oh my Antonio God. Brown! Whoa. He caught that with one hand, I think. One Antonio hit. Brown. What the heck, dude? <laughs> what a play. That was the Odell catch. The Odell catch of this like, league. Oh, my gosh, dude. What did he just do? Antonio Brown putting the Packers back into this. Back on top. They take the lead again. What Holy is going sh- on? This has, has got to be the best game. This has got to be up there. Wow. Wow, what a game as the Cardinals make a crucial mistake after holding them down the whole game. The rookie, Asante Samuel, huge mistake there as they take advantage of the matchup as now no no choice here but to return it. Christian Kirk takes it to the 25s and so ultimately a good play there as with a minute 12 left, but they still have three timeouts and all they need is a score to tie it back up. Let's see here if Kyler Murray can answer again here with a touchdown as now we have ourselves a bit of a shootout as all three of the last possessions have been led to touchdowns for both sides here as now Kyler Murray with the scramble. An interesting decision there as the clock still running here. Now second and five. Oh, come on, bro. Come on, come on. It's You realize there's 46 seconds left in the game. You got to at least give it a try to shoot it deep. Come on, dude. As now third and five here, third down. This is really, the Cardinals' last chance, unless you know, unless they you know get a big turnover, and you got to hold on to the ball in oh, that situation, Julio. Julio. Like if you're Julio Jones, you got to be holding on to the ball, or else. Yeah. You know, fourth and five, the game on the line here, five yards that could keep them alive here. Forty seconds left, finally throwing. Oh no, and it's to nobody there, and the Packers. Once again, escape death as they, after that San Francisco game and now Arizona, the NFC West being conquered at the last minute once more by the Packers as Aaron Jones with a nice run there. As you don't really forget, think they just running out, you know? Yep. They as, run the clock down. But they can't forget that the Cardinals do have two timeouts left. But yeah, now at this point with under 30, with 32 seconds left, that's pretty much the game here as the Cardinals, well, they're just taking those pity timeouts as the home fans leaving disappointed tonight as they almost come up with a win as the defense did everything it could. Just, yeah, 
just a bit of a poor performance from both offenses. But, I mean, sometimes, man, you know, good teams play good teams, man. You know, and yeah, it's been, been a real wild one here in this one. In the fourth quarter, I mean, we went through two straight quarters where it was just tight uh, as it gets. And, oh, don't do it. Don't do it, please. They're going to do, do it. it. They're going to do, do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Ah, now you've made it first. <laughs> the kick is gone. You, you, you've done this. Why have you done this? Why do you always do this, man? Rubbing, Why? Rubbing Why have you done the this? the wounds of all of uh, all. Oh, no. They there. better run off the field as fast as they can. As we wrap this one up at 24 to 14, they try to convince you the game wasn't as close as it was. As, yeah, big night here from uh, the Packers defense coming up huge. And Kyler, while Peter still Brown having the best catch of the season, probably. Oh, yeah, no doubt. As Kyler Murray, oh my gosh, almost had 100 yards scrambling alone with. 300 yards plus combined on the ground, somehow just not enough to win tonight. Just weren't able to convert, and the Packers squeak out another victory here. And anything else you want to say here before we wrap up, Trevor? I mean, I did. I did say you know best catch of the season. I think it's up best there catch. with with Thielen's catches. Oh yeah, Thielen had some clutch catches too. I mean, basically any – oh, that Debo Samuel play in overtime. I totally that, forgot. Oh, I forgot about that one also. Oh, there's yeah. Been some, there's been some great plays in this in the sim, but that is up there, one of the best plays so far. And as we wrap this one up here, a defensive matchup as the Packers edge this one out, as we say. I'm Houday, and this is the uh, ACFL coverage of this Thursday night game. I hope to see you later in the week uh, with this exciting matchup here to hopefully get yourself excited. as. Thank you for tuning in. Hope to see you later, folks.